All right, everybody. Welcome back to Animal Crossing. We're playing this during the Nature Day update. Right now, to encourage eco-friendly behavior on Moomin, we're celebrating Nature Day. May 4th is the final day of the special activities. Now let's get everyone in the eco-friendly spirit, everyone. Now for additional announcements. As I mentioned in yesterday's broadca broadcast, Nook's Cranny will be closed today. Oh yeah, I forgot. That was, a that was today, wasn't it? I can't go shopping today. Well, that's great. At least I'm going to get the new shop tomorrow. Well, sorry, people. <laughs> Grand reopening of the new uh, new and improved Nook's Cranny will be tomorrow morning at 8, 8 a.m. I'm sure you're all excited as I am to see how it'll look. Well, I'll get the next- I get the next sh shop. It's all right. I don't need to sell anything today anyway. That's fine. Have fun out there. All right. So people were just saying that apparently they nerfed time travel with this update. The, the bank gives you less interest each month. Oh, yeah, I moved my house as well. I'm now in the top right corner of the map in this little open area here. Let me turn this volume down a bit. It's kind of loud, isn't it? Bop. There we go. I don't need to catch any bugs. I can't sell them. Let's see. So I've been working on my town for a little bit. It's changed a bit, so here, here, instead of that park idea, I started working on this little, uh, neighborhood plaza. I was gonna start putting houses around. Right now, uh, there's just Kashmir's house, but I might need to move it anyway, because it's in the- it's a little too far to the right. But there's definitely not gonna be enough room on my island to give everyone their- this huge yard, so I'm just kind of making a little neighborhood in- in a couple spots. Hmm. And then there's Rex. Rex is just in my town. I think it looks nice so far, but I got more to do. Let me get my fossils. There we are. So, I know that we have the sloth here today, apparently. Trevor likes sloths, but I don't know if he'd like this one. He looks like he's got, like, weird Gesha makeup, I think you'd call it. Hey, hey, and welcome. What should I call you, friend? Me. Did you say that? Don't tell YouTube you said that. What a happy name. Oh, yes, I'm Leaf. I heard that my good pal Timmy started a shop here, so I thought I'd pay him a visit. Timmy told me this was a deserted island before you moved here. What a happy adventure. I bet you were up to your ear holes and weeds when you first arrived. But the island itself is a blank canvas that you can paint however you like. I hope some of the rare flower seeds and shrubs I brought with me will be featured in your final masterpiece. What's a shrub? Oh, what a happy coincidence! I was just thinking to myself... Oh my, hang on a second here, I know. Pardon me, I had to like clear my throat really loudly there. Mmm, happy coincidence. I was just thinking to myself that shrubs are too often overlooked. Shrubs are a kind are kind of like little trees, or they more like flowers, but bigger. However you see them, what matters is that they bloom seasonally and add something special to a garden. By the way, I'm selling the happiest shrub I know, the azalea. And lucky for us, it's currently in season, so we don't have to wait to appreciate its lovely blossoms. Anyway... Meeting you has been a true pleasure. I hope you see, hope to see you again soon. Okay, so he sells shrubs. I think they'd be cool to put down. He's a fun little sloth friend. What, what does he mean? What about weeds? Oh! Are you interested in selling weeds? Um, no, no. No, I'm not good, sir. Wait, no, that's okay in Canada. I forgot. I, I'm not interested in do that. Hmm. Yeah, I know how it feels to start pulling and suddenly realize, wow, this could take a while. Exactly. And I had a feeling. But gardening should make you happy. Which is why I decided to buy weeds from you at a very special high price point. And if you act now, I'll double what the nooklings are offering. That's 20 bells per clump of weeds. Okay. It's a win-win. You get paid for all that hard work you put into it. And I get to enjoy your pristine, weed-free island landscape. So, can I buy your weeds? Not right now. 
told you, you don't do this in front. We don't do this in front of the city, instead of the, in front of City Hall, man. You don't do that. You talk to me behind the buildings over there. I've introduced you to all the little seeds and saplings I got with me today. Pink azalea start. White azalea. Pink camellia. Okay. Yellow mum. Yellow lily. Red lily. Um, let me just... I mean, would you like... Um, I'll buy five. I got lots of money in the bank right now. Can you imagine if this update came out three days ago? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, oh, yes, yes. Oh, by the way, Akane, since you're here, um, are we still good for me to go to your island today? Since my shop is closed, you know, I got nothing better to do. You gotta do what makes you happy. I'll be here if you change your mind. Okay, so... I com sort of completed my shopping district. I moved the the museum, the Able Sisters. Nook's Cranny is here. Well, it's being remodeled. Got a little stall set up here. It's coming together. I got the campsite down here. It's looking pretty nice. I put a little phone booth in this one corner here. You can't use it, though. Um, I, I'm kind of waiting to get the right kind of, like, gate before I put, like, a uh, fencing around it. And back here, I'm sort of working on, like, a park area. Some kind of park pathway, I think, would be nice. I gotta- I, my house was here yesterday. I had to move it to the corner. I think it's coming together nicely, too. I've been enjoying, like, turning this on and working on customizing every day. Let me see what the shrubs look like. Because I think they'd be ni they'd make nice uh, natural fencing around here. Um, I can dig them up if they don't. Put them all around the water, maybe? Oh, no, no, don't do that. Maybe I should um, push the water back one square and put them there. I kind of just put the water there because uh, they can't really see what's behind the buildings. Yeah, you need to have a three-star island after, uh... You, get, you need a three-star island to get KK to come to your town. And then you get access to all, like, the terraforming construction options. It's fun. Let me try this. Talk to Tom Nook in the town hall for hedge fences. Oh. Let's go see him then. You can see I changed up my style a little bit too. I gotta check my machine anyway. I actually have a lot of money in the bank right now because I went ahead and um make a hedge maze. That wouldn't be a bad idea. I actually had Flick visit me on the same day that my turnips were like about I think around 200 for sell for selling. So I went ahead and just sold my turnips for. I think in total I made, like, more than 300k off that, and then I made, like, uh, a couple hundred thousand from selling all the bugs I stored to Flick. Let me see what I have in here, because I paid off my debt and stuff. Yeah, I have that much left in my bank, and that's how much is in my inventory, so I am real good for money right now. In fact, actually, I because I moved my house, I need to talk to Nook about upgrading it, because I paid off the debt and he wouldn't let me upgrade it until it's moved. So yeah, saving your bugs and fish for CJ and Flick is a good idea, trust me. For a limited time, we have a special Nature Day promotion for Nook Miles Plus members. During the event, we'll be giving out more miles than usual for your eco-friendly island activities. We'll always have a special gift, so participating or consider participating in the event, won't you? Of course, it's my hope that island residents will be eco-friendly all the time, not just around Nature Day. The dream... This construction consultation. Let's talk about my home. Shall we discuss? I want to expand. Why, with a hammer and some elbow grease, we can put a large one-room second story on your home. Of course, adding a whole new floor does entail heavy construction fees. We'll be talking about... Ooh! I don't think I've ever seen it get this high. 
What was the highest it went in um, New Leaf? I honestly don't remember if I really did everything in New Leaf. New Leaf was fun, but I ended up kind of getting bored of it to at a certain point. It gets higher. Oh, boy. Well, I'll just have to stay, save my uh, save my stuff for Flick and CJ still. But I'm wondering now, because I'm upgrading my home, can I still move a citizen's house? What you have in mind? Uh, layout changes? Okay, I can. Um, let's see. In New Leaf, the debts were lower, but there were a lot more. Hmm. Um, I'll, let me think about who I want to move today. Because I can only move one thing. I got all the shops in the campsite move. What, about, what should I do? Is he going to give me the... Yes, yes, that is the question. Can't think of any more advice to give you. You've accomplished so much. I'm sure you could find your own ways of having life. Cedar sapling. Let me check the, this thing. I need to check what my fences are. Redeem Nook Miles. Matisse fence, rope fence. I already have rope fence, don't I? You already have this one. Ah, I hate how it's random every day. This one looks nice, though. I don't know if it's what I really want for my shopping district, but... I'll take it. Gotta learn them. Uh, no, I don't need to do that anymore. Hmm, okay. Learn the Latisse fence. What do I have here? Oh yeah, I found another Kotatsu and a balloon. Oh boy. Have I been buying the albums each day? I actually have not. I kind of don't, didn't really care too much. I probably should. Okay, so here's my shopping district. I have some other ideas for it. Aside from putting fencing around, I want to kind of put like outdoor tables in this area. And I'm thinking maybe another fountain or like a central, like some kind of central piece or something. I can't really find a good spot for the vending machines because putting them on their side, they look ugly because the way this game's camera is. Did your sheep end up moving? No, he's still here. Don't worry. He's a, he's a good boy and he ain't going nowhere. Is he home? I'm having fun somewhere else. Still in town. Yes, I got good old American Kotatsu. And it's mine. Mine. I still haven't changed my flag for some reason. Oh, there he is. Hey, Boopy. How you been, Indeedaroo? I want to chat. Muscle Madness. <laughs> wow, I heard shouting is a great way to work the abs. I also heard my neighbors were complaining. Boopy. He's so cute. Look, I got a fossil. Now I haven't been to Akane's Island yet. We're gonna do that in a bit. But, um, I also need to... Crazy Red is in my town, too. He is part of the update. I think he shows up along the beach somewhere. Oh, what's up? Pardon me for not noticing you. I got a lot on my mind right now. Out of curiosity, what would your reaction be if I was to tell you that I was planning to move away? Shock? Nausea? A dead faint? Nothing too dramatic, I hope. For that's exactly what I'm pondering. Has the time come for me to make a change, or should I settle for staying here? What do you think? I don't want to say... I've barely spoken to this person, but I, I kind of don't want, want her to leave. I feel so mean. Ah, oh. I feel... I always feel sad about this, because I, I, I don't... Yeah... I want to get other villagers, but I don't want to. I don't want them to go away. It's so mean. Get over it, Weenie. She barely spoke with her. That's probably why she wants to go.
Bon voyage. No. No. There's better people to be mean to. Or tell to go away. No! She deserves better. Bon voyage. Alright, fine. It's not that I needed your approval, but it's nice to have them nonetheless, chicken. Though I shall be gone, I trust my memory will loom large in the minds of Moomin. Alright. I want to go for other villagers. It sucks to say, just be like that, because I don't want anyone to feel sad. Nobody should feel sad. But they're virtual Animal Crossing villagers. Meh. Dang it. I mean, no, honestly, so far the only villagers I really want to keep... There's the gold spot up there. I'll deal with it later. Obviously, there's Dom. Um, and then there's, um... Yeah, Poppy's cute. I... I don't know. I haven't really... There's, uh, there are a couple of them I just kind of don't really talk to. Hang on a second. It's not up here, is it? No. You'll feel bad when you see her packing up. What do you mean by secret beach? I'm not entirely sure by that. I mean, I've barely spoken to her. A lot of these villagers I only have just because I can't progress the game without them. I hear the balloon. this. Come on, balloon. People are telling me to go to that northern patch of land where the beach was, but didn't we just go there and he wasn't there? I got that. That was not really worth it at all. He ain't here, he ain't here. Nothing I can really do about that. People are... So he can't be here the same day that Leaf is here. So how do people know... How have people already been talking to him? Thank you for checking in with little me so often today. Let's chat. Deliver my change of address from... To Form to resident services, get cardboard box for packing. What else? Goodness, so much to do, so little time. Moving such a chore, and yet I'm quite upbeat about it. Can't say no to that now. But chat, I have a chance of getting Raymond to come to my island. And I can sell him for a thousand dollars. Good old little Dom there. Hmm. Let's see. Now what should I take care of? All oh, right, there were fosses up there I wanted to grab. I have Raymond. Oh, do you? Same. Are you gonna sell him? No. No, I love him. Okay, so you're one of the people that would pay a thousand dollars for him. Oh, give me that. As soon as his amiibo releases, he will lose all value. Probably. If they ever release it. I mean, people are buying bells right now in this game. 
People really want to want their Animal Crossing. Hmm. See, that's three fossils. I, I I need to find one more. I don't remember if I saw it. I was running around looking for red. Okay. Well, we'll see about it. I think. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? That's a waste of time. Why did a rock have to appear here? That's what I get for smashing them. Yeah, up here. Not around here. I just want to get my last fossil before I go to, uh, Blathers. Oh, boy. You managed to find Anka on an island? Oh, boy. There are some villagers that people really want. Honestly, I'd be fine if Rex moved. Rex is kind of... He has an ugly shirt. I don't hate him, but, hey... That's a real- it's a really ugly shirt. Oh boy, oh boy. That's kind of rude. He's not real. <laughs> you can tell Isabel you hate his shirt and he will change it. Really? I'm joking, you people. It's a fictional lion. I've not done, designed any clothes, no. Hmm. Where or where could that fossil be? There it is. No, no, no. Give them a shirt. When I give people shirts, they never wear them. They kind of just switch back, and then they don't. Mine. Don't clap or anything. You can go too, you, you dumb frog. Meanwhile, Clay still wears his poop hat. Muscular time and boopy. We were just trying to figure out how to show everyone what an awesome place Moomin is. Yep. Dancing is super hot right now, so I want to jump on stage to do a big dance show. I'll totes wow the whole crowd. Dom, you're one of the backup dancers, okay? What? You're kidding, right? We're gonna put on a weightlifting competition, and you're gonna be my spotter. Um, no. Weightlifting. Nuh-uh. I'm supposed to be in the spotlight, not spot-ting. If anything's gonna be in the spotlight, it should be my mega muscles. Hey, you gotta be our tiebreaker, Boopy. What do we do? Mmm, Dom, your idea is kind of stupid, though. <laughs> Fight time. Your idea is really stupid, Dom. Dance show. I know, right? Who wouldn't want to see me dancing? I'm gonna be so famous, hey, okay? Alright, Dom. You're a backup dancer. Go get fitted for a donut costume, okay? D -d donut costume? Come on! Does it at least have an abs window? Aw, oh, indeed a rule. You're having fun. Dom disliked that. He will remember. Okay, fight queen. No, for real, though, I don't feel happy when it, when anyone leaves my town, but I want to get other villagers, you know? Because I'm just going to end up ignoring Queen, Queenie, the whole time. I stopped Dom from leaving, yes. Hang on a second now. Got everything. Let's just go check these, and, um... I guess I could go to... Uh, Connie, can I go to your town now? Let me do that. Prepare it for me. Huh? Who? Oh dear, pardon me. 
Good morning. Welcome to the Moon Museum. Well, I've been meaning to tell you the good news. Hooty hoo! Thanks to your hard work and the support of the good folks of Moomin. The museum can now display more specimens than ever before. Thus, I am considering adding the fine works of art fine works of art to this fine institution's repertoire. So if you should find yourself in possession of a piece of art, by all means, please do show it to me. Don't forget to bring a ladder. Okay. So where is the art section? It's not in the main entrance now, apparently. Hang on. Limited time, nature day stuff. Plant shrub starts. Get rocks. I'll do that. It gets added after you give them the first piece of art. All right. So I need to, I need red for that though. Oh, he fell asleep when I looked at my phone. Wake up, wake up, hoot. Hmm. Assess fossils, friend. Would you like me to assess? I'm all a flutter. Ooh, more than one, one I see. Let us take a closer look. Look. Ooh, I found something that's not yet part of our esteemed collection. It's magnificent indeed. You have a talent for finding fossils. Alright. Now let's donate to them. Donate them to the museum. I feel like it's going to be really easy to eventually fill up the, the, muse the fossils in the museum. You find four every day, so you have a pretty good chance of always... Yeah, see, I completed another dinosaur. I feel like I'm completing one every day now. No, not right now. I don't need to read the facts, sorry. Okay, so I might need to store some stuff at my house so I can steal stuff from your island. Hmm. Yeah, last few fossils will take you forever to get, just because. Hang on a second, I get one for taking a quick picture. What a bad one to put there. It's like, why? Okay, now my house is up top. I gotta do that. Uh, can I plant the shrubs here first? Let me do that. No! Are you kidding me? Why did it go behind me? Dig a hole first. Okay, fair enough. Are those too close to each other? I honestly can't even tell. I need three more there, though. I got Static as a camper today. I kept begging him to come to town, and we managed to kick him out for- kick out another villager to get him. I didn't even realize that was possible. That sounds horrible! Kix is on my island, not shrubs. Did you update the game? Because apparently there's a glitch that if you start the game before the update, it uh will make the sloth not appear. Shrubbery hubbubbery. Uh-huh. Ooh. Oh, did you do that? Oh, you did that, didn't you? That's not good. People were saying that when I... 
it was set it was setting up the stream. I'm just gonna buy three more shrubs first. I have both leaf and red together right now. That's it does is I don't understand why he's not appearing. Now I gotta buy three. Oh, Red is back. He's back, everybody. He doesn't appear until the day after Blathers tells you about, about art. Why? Why do you have to wait a day on that? That is bad. Mm. Well... This is the third one I bought now, I hope. Well, whatever. I should have just bought five and sucked up the, the extra two ones I would have had in the inventory. And now what do I got? Yeah, three. Okay. So people were suggesting a hedge maze... I think maybe I can do that, because I, I wanted to make the northern e exit here to lead to, like, a little park-like area. I might keep keep this bridge here, but I'm probably going to move Winnie's house and maybe alter the mountain a bit. Maybe I should expand, like, put a village, maybe put another neighborhood nearby. Because the idea of giving everyone their own big yard, it's just not going to work. It's just not going to work. Hedge mage with a bridge that bridges the way out. That'd be cool. Oh. One of the things I was also thinking that somebody made... So, you know how you can make wooden path, right? I seen someone on Twitter. What they did was, in, like, the center of their town, they made, like, a, they made the highest uh, amount of cliff that they could. And they effectively made a gigantic land bridge. And they put nothing but the wood, wooden path down, and put a big wooden fence on both sides, and it looked like this gi just giant bridge that went through the middle of town, and it looked so sick, and it's like, I want to do that. I want to do that. Because that's the only way you can have an elevated bridge in this game, because the bridges are so limited. Hmm. I think that would be really cool to do. Because, like, they, at the, the far ends on both sides, they put waterfalls to also kind of hide the fact that it's actually land. It just looked like a big wooden bridge. I'm probably not explaining it the best, but it looked really cool. That does sound cool. Let's see. Anyways, what I need to do is put... Let's see. Uh, okay, so we learned to DIY. Put stuff in my house, but my house isn't here anymore. I need to go to the top corner. So, quick question, chat. Because Queenie is moving out now, which I, I do feel bad about that, but whatever. I want to get different villagers. I'm too softy. I'm the guy that gets upset when I pick the mean options in RPGs. Then, uh... Let's see, let's see, what was I, what was I thinking? Because Queenie's moving out, does this mean I, if I go to Nook Islands, Nook Miles Island, I can, like, get someone to show up at the town? Bank of Nook, we are right inform you of reduce the interest rate offered to all savings accounts. Oh, apology and inconvenience, please enjoy the attached gift. You hear that, time travelers? Because of you, they had to reduce this. Good job. Interest rate went down. I can't, I can't believe I get a message like this in Animal Crossing. Yes? Thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show our appreciation. I really don't... No, I don't care what you do at your game. It's your game. You paid for it. I don't care if you want to bully Dom. That If you paid $60 to do that, more power to you. There's Rex and Tom Nook. I'm going to advise you some special Nook Miles activities that are available until May 4th as a part of Nature Day. Ends right after my birthday. Yes, yes, I do hope you come see more details. My birthday is May 3rd. You know, come to think of it, this is going to be a really crappy birthday this year, isn't it? Stuck inside the way we are. Gosh, I didn't even think of that. That's depressing. Bell bag rug. Money. World map.
Mm. I remember when people were saying, like, oh, my birthday's in March, and this has been pretty crappy. I'm like, ah, but mine's in May. And then I'm like, oh, mine's in May. Mine's in May. I get a world map, and that's actu the actual world. Chat, where in the world is my island? Earth is real. Money bags. Now, let's see. I'm going to put this stuff away so I can sell it to Flick. I guess the fossils as well. Um... May, may as well put the materials away. Wait, I can sell... Wait a second. I can sell stuff in your town. I just realized that. Never mind. Go away the Kotatsu. I don't need the wood. But there's no reason to bring axes. Because I can't use them in your town. Can I even use the slingshot? Let's see. No, I can't use a shovel either, so I'll put that away. Man, I, rec I recognize this KK music from all the way back in the GameCube days. Let's see. Fishing net ladder, you said. Um, Whatever, I'm gonna just store this stuff. Keep the weed. Hang on, I'm gonna hide the screen when I put the code in. Your birthday's in October. I have a cousin whose birthday is actually on Halloween. So after I go to your island, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the Nook Miles Island, see if I can get a random villager. And then I'm gonna get Raymond live on stream and I'm gonna put him in the thumbnail surrounded by dollar signs and then i mean it's gonna get a mil get a million views and then i'm gonna and plot twist i'm gonna have a happy birthday this year balloons don't spawn after visiting oh oh well selling shots in my inventory i have a lot Welcome to one and only Gateway to the Skies. Can I help you? I want to fly. Roger. I want to visit someone. Let's play online play. Let me connect to the internet. Roger. Connect to the internet. Apparently it doesn't matter if I hide this for... I, I guess I have to hide this for the Twitch stream, but the Dodo codes change every time, so it does not matter if people see it on the YouTube upload. Uh, search via Dodo code. Enter the Dodo code for me. No, I don't care, to be honest. I mean, still. You never know. Hang on a second. Give me... Did you DM me the code or something? Hang on. Let me see. I'm just gonna hide things. Let me just open Twitter right quick. Body yada yada. There is enough in here. Oh, you just put it in chat? <laughs> okay, oh, so much for that. I might as well not even hide the screen anymore. <laughs> Everyone can see it. Okay, fine. You can just kick whoever shows up. <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> Looks like we got a flight for Oneth right now. Let's fly. Getting ready to depart. Can't kick? It's dumb. It kicks everyone. Oh. We'll just close it right away. Looks like I forgot to check. Oh, whatever. I'll take my helmet off. I'll put it. be putting it back on for Mario Maker, though. Get going. Here we go. Now, 
I know you've been preparing this town for a bit, and I'm kind of concerned, because I know what you probably are going to do. What am I going to see when I fly over? This is the price I get for visiting towns. Hey, it looks normal. Hey, look, there you are. There's a garbage can. Local time is 11.54. We got clear skies. We'll be making water lit. <laughs> of course. Hmm. Oh, no. I knew there was going to be something as soon as I flew over. That's perfectly normal. It doesn't go against any terms. Oh, your dodo station's blue? Oh, there's your flag. I can't dig any anything up. I see how it's gonna be. Hey, I got an achievement. Joke's on you. Overcoming pitfalls. Life is full of peaks and valleys, hills and pits, but you fall into a pit. You learn a lesson, hmm? Be more careful next time. Yes, don't feel too bad, though. You're getting some bonus miles for your fall. For your fall. This is what I get for telling you I'm coming coming here. You decide to set things up like the kid from Home Alone. What is with that net? It's just a star shape. Where'd you get that? And now I'm going to be attacked. Absolutely attacked. Hang on, let's go to your... Oh, you got... Oh, it's still called Nook's Cranny? I didn't realize that. I thought they changed the name like to stuff like Nook and Go. Nookway and Nookingtons. So you have a little neighborhood over here. That's cute. Hey, it's Raymond! The hello, thumbnail! Nice to meet you. I'm Count Raymond Duonet. Just kidding. I didn't move here all that long ago. Anyway, what's your name? Hmm, Christian, eh? Cool. Hope to see you around. I didn't think you were serious when you said you had Raymond, to be honest. There he is. Thumbnail. Hang on. Let me get a picture. No, no, no. Hold still. Come back. Turn around. I need, to get a, I need to get a good picture of him. Come on, this one's for the thumbnail, Raymond. What is that bear? Get get out of here! You're ruining my picture! Oh, there he goes. I'm meeting a celebrity chat. I need to get a good picture. Oh, thank you. Oh, he turned around. <laughs> he just had to turn around. You had him right there. Come on. Didn't mean to turn on the filters here. What is... Look at this little fella. Don't, see, don't think I've seen you around these parts. You a tourist? Hey, your name's Humphrey. You picked the right island to visit. Let me tell you, Onet's just perfect. Don't let me stop you. Go nose around. Try to talk to folk and enjoy yourself. You always have that certain... I don't know what that says, don't you? That's French for really cool haircut. I want to chat. Normally, I like to be at the center of attention, but on Nature Day, nature is the true star of the show. Take a minute to appreciate the trees that provide food and shade. Beautiful flowers that brighten our days, and even those persistent weeds we just can't stop. No, you don't, mister. No, no, you get, you, you get back in the frame right now. Raymond, you're ruining the thumbnail. Talk to 
talk to him. Hold him still. Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, stop moving! Stop moving! I'm trying to get a picture with you! <laughs> okay, okay, let's do it. Let's, let's get him this time. Trying to get a creepy picture. Now everybody was in the frame. Okay. No, 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 you turn around, mister. Can you just look at the- look at- look. Turn. No! Face the camera! Why is this so hard for you? There! That's the best I'm gonna get. That's the best I'm gonna get. Press R. You can do that. Oh. Sort of helps, but if he's walking away, he's still walking away. I have found the main attraction here. He acts just like a real cat. <laughs> Free shit. Hey! Is that CJ? That's CJ. I'm assuming this is fine. This is fine, right? I'm assuming that the sign when when it says free, it's free. Knight's helmet. I'm assuming you don't you already know these and you don't need them. Where are you? Follow you for what? What? Why is there an anti goose sign here? can't go inside. I'm waiting. It's low. Okay, it's loading. Everybody wants Raymond. Oh, you got Scoot! Got stuck there. Another celebrity. Hey ya! Uh -huh. Did I scare ya? My bad. Sometimes I get a little too pumped up and then I get a little too loud. It's Scoot! Scoot! You hear visiting, right? That's so cool. My name's Scoot. I'm kind of new here, but I'd love to have an off-island workout, buddy. All right. Whatever nonsense you want to put on your island here, Akane, it's perfectly fine because I got Raymond in the thumbnail. Raymond in the thumbnail. Birthday has been saved this year. Funny goose sign. We're open. Oh, what's this? I guess you're building something there. You got an outdoor little bar here. That's cool. That's a nice idea. I think I'll steal it. Can't hit me. Wait, he had something else to say? Oh, no. Did you teach him a bad word? You taught him a bad word. Oh. Came back. Just one surprise after an okay. <laughs> you did teach him a bad word. Why? Why would you teach him such things? There's too much awesome stuff for sale at Nook's Cranny. It's super fun to just look around there. And carrying your stuff home is great for the arms. His house is Scoot's house is so weird. It's it's a backyard inside. He has an outdoor toilet inside his house. He sleeps on the ground. And he has a pool. What a weird fella. Ha 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 ha. He he funny. You know funny? I bet it's funny. Give me that. Peacock butterfly. I should do some fishing and for uh, CJ while I'm here. What do you have here? This is a nice idea. I like this. Here's 
Your fountain's that color. Right, the fountains can be different colors. That's your museum. You know, spent a long time on this. I worked very hard on it. You got a hoot sign. You got an outdoor little camp area. Your island's looking nice. It's fun visiting islands. You have, uh... You don't have any cherry blossoms, but you have these little pink flowers here instead. These cherry blossom trees were too short-lived. Should catch the fish. Nice use of the waterfalls. I like that. I'm gonna steal. I like visiting islands because it makes it gives me ideas to steal. Go to the very back of the camp. What's waiting for me there? I don't know if I can get this fish. Hold up a sec. You got snacks and you got oh a change room. A change room that you can't change at. Oh, you got a Danny DeVito? You got a Danny DeVito little, sa little, little shrine here. My goodness. Visitors can't get changed at other islands. Oh, that's right. You got a, you got a Korok mask. Does that have a gold axe? Can't pick anything up, though. Beautiful. Mental, mate. Absolutely mental. You can with a wand. Teacups. What else is here? Give me fish. I'm gonna sell the CJ while I can. It's a trash, man. Absolutely trash. Last thing to look at is the upper left corner. This is a nice end to the beach here. Stuff like this makes me want to customize my town more, but the thing about the customization is I feel like once I'm done customizing, I'm never going to do it again because it takes forever. So I'm never going to make any changes once I'm done. But at the very least, I can keep visiting other people's towns like this. Like, I'll, I'll happily visit... Oh, you made a graveyard? That's actually... This is actually a cool idea. I want to make a graveyard, too. You even got little incense burning. Oh, I never, I've never i never seen anyone do this yet. This is cool. How do you make these tombstones? I don't think you can sell the CJ on other islands. Man, you just want to kick me while I'm down, don't you? What's up, Fishinista? CJ here, coming at you live from, uh, here. I'm touring the islands looking for fresh faces and fresher fish to show off on my live stream. See, fishing is reeling in major streaming numbers right now. Heard of eSports? This is C-Sports. Anyway, I need new fish if I want to keep my followers following, so I'm going to ask the local anglers to help out. It's a pretty simple setup. I buy their fish at a premium. So they cash out, I get new selfies from my blog, and my viewers get to hear me talk fish. Everyone wins. I'm working on a cemetery myself. Hey, what's up? You fishing out here? Pro tip. Make friends with a local and ask them about the best fishing spots. You never know what's out there. I'm gonna be casting my show here for a while longer. We'll catch up next time I'm on Moomin. Alright. He won't... Yeah, he's not gonna let me. I can't sell things to CJ here. But this is cool. But yeah, in the future, I'd like to... I, I expect, when I stream this, to do a lot of just visiting other people's towns. Just because it's fun to do, it's fun to look at everything, because customizing my town is fun, but I like seeing other people's places. So, you know, if anyone want, if anyone has, like, their town set up a special way, I can come next time, maybe. Let's see. It takes a long time to do it your island the way you want. I've just been doing mine little by little. It's working out. Nice flowers. I need to take the rest of those recipes you left there. Let's see. Look around here. There's unfortunately not too much to do. Uh-huh. 
pitfalls. There's a bear. I don't remember seeing you before. Are you visiting from off island? Your name Christian? Well, it's great to meet you. Call me June. I love meeting new friends. Mm-hmm. I don't I actually I don't have a theme to my town yet. I'm just gonna relax here for a moment. Uh yeah, yo 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 yeah, yo yo sent me a thing for the town tune. But I didn't implement it yet. So I was gonna do that. But people seem to like what I've done with my town so far. Like, it took days, and it just worked on it. <laughs> Final notice of eviction? What did, you, what did you put here? I'm sorry, that, that caught me off guard. <laughs> oh no, not Poppy! Oh, it's not Poppy. I thought it was Poppy from behind. They look like exactly the same. But I don't believe we met before. I'm Pecan, and you are Christian. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. It's a darling little island, lovely as a daisy, and a feel of the grass. Well, I do hope you enjoy your stay. No, I don't think all squirrels look the same. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just got caught off guard. I, I can't believe there's you actually got a custom thing for <laughs> an eviction notice. That makes me laugh. Hey, there he is. How's it going, man? I'm never going to see this guy again. Crisp or what? Well, then again, I doubt Akane's ever going to get rid of him, so I can always come back and visit. Lay it on me. Hey, you know Akane? They live right here on Onet, Crisp. Well, here's something you might not have known. They also go by Wasteful Trash. It's almost like they have a secret identity. I've got to get one of those. Raymond putting you down. Where is your house now? I haven't been there yet. Which one of these is your house? Clyde's house. Oh, it's in the top. Right. I saw the cemetery. You can also sell stuff at uh, Nook's there, or maybe buy things. Does buying things at, at your island help you, uh, get- help you, uh, get- unlock the next nook thing? <laughs> Beware of talk. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> this is your island's legitimately funny, making me laugh here. What's this? Give me a little spiral thing here. Now, now I'm afraid to go inside. Money you spend counts towards total spent to the shop. There's only one upgrade right now. I Really? So you can only upgrade Nooks once until they update it. Your house looks normal. When is it not going to be normal? Oh boy. This is just a little little kitchen. The microwave looks like everything it looks like it's gonna fall off this table. Yo, I need a drink. Good. I see, guess it makes sense. Now I'll go in the basement last. Because I'm afraid that's where the worst is gonna be. Basement's gonna be one of those. Oh, trash room! <laughs> you can do that to the computer! <laughs> I didn't know that until today. Well. <laughs> nice room. Nice poster. Buff scoot. What, what did I- Did I just step on a cockroach? Wait, cockroaches are still in this game? I didn't know that. No, Raymond is still the thumbnail, trust me. 
Trust me, Raymond is still the thumbnail. Especially since she put him in the in the frilly pink outfit. Nicely. Guess what makes sense. Turn the tap on. Shower can't be used. How did you get a gold toilet? Oh, I stepped on it again. Now we go upstairs. Oh. Oh. Somebody's waiting for Flick to arrive, aren't they? Oh my. <laughs> Jesus. I was debating whether or not to make a bingo card before I came to this island, but I don't think I would have gotten anything, because everything is just not what I was expected. Check the basement and get out. <laughs> Imagine them breaking out. <laughs> oh no. What have you done down here? What is this floor? Why is it squishy? Are those scissors and knives patterned on the wall? Oh. All right, I'll leave now. Chat, I count 120 tarantulas. Oh, you did the math right there, did you? Well, this island is probably one of the most cursed but hilarious things I've seen. Thank you for the, the YouTube audience. Blah. No, thank you for pleasing the YouTube audience, no doubt. Oh boy. I've barely even done anything with my own house, to be honest. I've mostly just been working on the town. What can I really do? But I really like the cemetery idea. I th I'm gonna steal this from you, like legit. I'm gonna steal this from you. <laughs> it looks good. Make maybe make I could also make like a little entrance to the side for like a gravekeeper's like yard and just put one of the villager houses there. I give this island a 420 out of 69. Hmm. Get that there. Are you allowed to have a certain amount of waterfalls? I know that you have a, can only have a certain amount of uh, bridges and inclines. Oh, give me a... Come on. Alright, get out. Hang on, let me get this fish, and, uh, check those cards you left out. Hmm? I need this fish now. Considering someone turned their entire island into a giant lake, I don't think there's a limit to waterfalls. What? Someone did that? That sounds like such a pain to undo. Ooh, whoa. I'm gonna steal some trading cards now. Oh, right. I didn't visit the Able Sisters or the Nook, sh Nook Shop yet. Sorry, you're stuck with me right now. Don't worry, I'll put back whatever I can't use. Because I want to get more DIY stuff. Especially the, the fruit stuff is a little difficult to get when it's not your native. You got something for me? I don't know if I want to know what that is. Of course you did. My name isn't Raymond. Fossil door plate. I think I have that. Palm tree lamp. 
Well, thanks for leaving out the extra cards cards for people. Wait, is that free money too? Is that money for me? I'm not wearing it. Manga library wall. Sweet, I learned manga library wall. Okay, I can take the money. Good. The money is not in exchange for wearing the outfit, by the way. I learned angled signpost. Put it on. Listen, chat, this isn't one of those streams where I wear such clothing for your amusement. Oh, but I will learn how to craft it. Please wear... Okay, that's a lot of money. Darn. I'm almost obligated now. Take the money, you have to. Wear and get another photo with Raymond. You'll match. Where even is he? Think of the thumbnail. I don't know where he is though. Ha 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 ha, very funny. <laughs> I see Hamphrey. Did he go inside his house or something? It's the goose house. Hamphrey's house. Do you know where Raymond is? There, well, I found his house. He has a skull on the door plate. Okay, he's still out. No, I'm not even... When I say that people are selling Raymond for $1,000, that's not a joke. People people are legitimately paying hundreds, and some guy apparently 1000 to, to to get Raymond in the town. All right, here we go. Fine. For the photo. Now we're near this. Hang on. Come back! No. Too close. There. Satisfied? I got it. thumbnail has been gotten. The thumbnail has been obtained. Everybody loves Raymond. Alright, um, is that everything now? Right, the shops. I didn't- I still haven't checked the, checked them out. You already got shrubs set up, I see. Maybe I'll just take these to sell. Which, oh, those were big stacks of weeds. I'm just gonna take it. It's- it's okay. We're both in Canada. It's legal. City Hall, I don't need to go in there. What am I thinking? Uh, where the heck was the nook? Oh, it's over here. Let's go inside. Oh, look how cute they are. I may as well sell what stuff I have. They're not really selling anything I need. I'm impressed you travel all the way to our fair island. Who are you? Eh, I can save the peacock butterfly for a flick. 
I'll just store these. I can't just sell them now. Confirm. 6,000. Thanks so much. Much. Okay, now let me go see what clothes the Able Sisters have. And that should be good. Oh, big butterfly. You got a lot of flowers out, so the butterflies are really around today. Um, okay, it was loading. Let's go. Waiting. Do you know me here, Sable? Huh? Sorry, I'm a little busy right now. Hello there. Do you need the fitting room? Go right ahead. Hmm. Anything here I want? Fairy tale dress. Treasure. Wrestling. Singlet. Ah. Acorn knit hat. What is this? Knit hat. Ah, I don't need that. Bubble gum. Nee. Mustache. Facial hair should not exist on Animal Crossing humans. Ever. Uh, nothing really I want to get here. Nothing caught your eye? Yeah, I'm good. People who put eyebrows on their characters are cursed. Alright, so I think that's it. Thanks for inviting me to your island. It was wonderful. I'm sure I will, we'll be coming here again. Thanks for the thumbnail. And the silliness. Uh, no reason to take the shells, actually. Your island certainly was something, I can say that. Oh, I, guess I see. Yeah, okay. Goodbye. I'm leaving. I'll make sure it'll be worse. Absolutely worse, I bet. I want to go home. I definitely want to go home. Getting ready to go home. Get me out of here, mister. The crap I put up with to meet a celebrity. I met the f I met the the funny cat man for free. Today I apparently also learned that you can edit what's on a computer screen when you um get the computer desk. I did not know you could custom design that. I know people have made some really weird things that I definitely don't want to show on stream or YouTube. Like I've seen I've seen some weird custom design shenanigans that um uh that yeah, people are saying in chat that I don't want to read out loud. But if you want me to visit your town, yeah, don't don't put any stuff like that. Ugh. I got Nook Miles for visiting. Now we're back home. So, so far I'm liking how my town's laid out. I really want to make some stuff. There's Rex. I like you. Oh, look at little puppy! How's your day going, nutty? It's a little harder to get going when the sky is cloudy. I like Poppy and Dom. They're cute. Hey, and Dideroo. Working up a good sweat? Let's chat. Find any cool fossils yesterday? I get so pumped imagining how strong dinosaurs were in Dideroo. Cashmere's fine. Again, I don't I'm not I'm not, I don't want, I don't want to bully villagers out of my town, but at the same time, I want to cycle through some of them because 
There are literally hundreds of villagers in this game. And I don't want to just play the entire game with the same set of them. It feels bad to let them go, but, you know. Hmm. Yeah, I'd say Akane's town is ki is just at the line of probably what's okay to show. Like, if I go into someone's town and I'm flying over a custom design laid out in the middle of town that's shaped like a shaped like something bad, I'll probably just immediately leave and then cut it from the YouTube upload. Let's go to the Nook Shopping. Special goods. Oh, Animal Crossing Nintendo Switch. Wow. Floor light. Mesh cap. Old glasses. Hello tea. Kunichiwa tea. Denim skirt. Rain boots. Surfing KK. I guess I'm gonna start buying these. I'll just put them in storage. Hmm. Right. Let me go get a Nook Miles ticket, and let's go see if I can get a random villager. Chat, how much do you think I can... How, what are the odds? Place your bets. Who am I gonna get? Am I gonna get Marshall, Raymond, or even Anka? I'd be okay with them living in my town, just because they're valuable. I can, I can charge people a premium just to visit. What's that? Do you want to visit famous Pokemon YouTuber Pika Spray's Island? Nah, that's dumb. That's dumb. He's got Raymond. Oh, Raymond! Raymond? I'll pay a hundred to visit that. People are throwing out names and I don't even know who they are. Also, I got money. You want Muffy. The big goth GF for Dom. I actually have the amiibo card for Muffy. I actually- I also have the amiibo card for, uh, Poppy. I actually- I have amiibo cards for quite- for some actual of- Yeah, valuable amiibo cards, sorry. Like, uh, stutter- stutter in here. Let me go get my, uh, tools for my house. I'm not used to my house being on the other side of town now. I just- I keep going to where it used to be. Let's see. Another reason I kind of want to maybe go for specific vi villagers is because, you know, I kind of want to give them a little personality outside their house. These can go in storage for Flick. I guess I'll have to store this as a souvenir. Uh, I'll just- I'll just drop this on the ground. Put in storage. I can- I should give these to, um, the sloth belt- sloth boy. No, I want to pick up the shovel for crying out loud. I could probably also just put it in the bank. What, what did I do there? Okay, I'm just gonna go to the bank after this. I'll take the flimsy axe. I'm trying to break as many flimsy axes as possible so I can, um, get my hands on the gold axe. Gosh, this game is fun. I like playing this game every day. So, as for customize, when it comes to customizing my town chat... Who, sh who should I move? Because right now, I think maybe I'm going to put, like, four houses here. Like, one here, one there, one here. So basically move this house a little to the left. And then do the same for the left side right here. To make a little... And then I'm going to raise the cliffs around all the, no all the empty spots once the houses are in place. And it'll make this nice, fun little plaza. Maybe put some flowers and a bench or something down here. I didn't mean to pick that up. Drop that. And, um... And over here, I'm, I'm also really digging the idea of, like, a little hedge maze. But what I'm also thinking of is... So, yeah. Let me hang on a second. Let me go over here. Hedge maze for this spot. And then maybe over here, I'm gonna... I'm thinking of raising the raising the the terrain behind City Hall because you can't really put anything behind City Hall because it's in the way. Hmm. <clears throat> and then around this mountain area is where I'll start making that huge land bridge that goes like completely forward to this spot of the map. I think that would be really cool. It's gonna take a while to do though. 
It's hard to explain, convey what I mean in words, but I think it'll look nice. So far, I've, I've got all my uh, town, and the camp and everything is just kind of organized in this little plaza with the city hall. I think it looks really good so far. The plaza with the, the little neighborhood in the center there is going to look nice too. Hmm. I almost have all my dream villagers. I just need Raymond. But you're definitely not getting Raymond from Akane. Anyways. I need to sell my weeds now and uh, go to the bank. Hey, uh, I got something. I got something for you. Got some hot stuff from uh, another town. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You want more? You call me. Not in front of the building, you understand? That's right. Let's get out of here. People like Raymond because he looks sassy. And there's there's memes about him in a maid outfit. And he has heterochromy eyes. Like, two, two, two eyes, or each eye is a different color. So he just looks super awesome for people. Let's see, deposit, uh... Let's put this much away for now. Anything else I need? Nope, Nook Miles ticket is fine. I can't really sell stuff right today. All right, so let's go to the island and let's get a random villager. So, how does it work? How does the process work again? It's like, what what is Rex doing? He's just sitting in like the most awkward spot. How you doing? I want to chat. Another neat day on Moomin, cool cat. Yeah. What I so I think is when you meet a villager. I just realized my dodo place is, uh, my dodo airplane place is, uh, airport, that's the word I'm looking for, is yellow. I guess that fits me. You see them on the island, and you invite them to the campsite, and then in the campsite, you talk to them in order to, um, in order, in order to make them, uh, move in. Sorry, I'm, I'm, my, I have a brain fart. I'm trying to remember words, and I just think of, and I just think of what's, what was on Akane's computer when I was in her room. I'm sorry, I just keep laughing at that. I'm, I'm snickering. You won't find villagers on islands until your lot is empty. I thought someone said earlier that I could technically find them now that someone's planned to move out. I hope you're proud of yourself because your island is basically going to become the gold standard of every comedian that wants me to visit their island now. Everybody and their grandma is going to be like, oh man, check this out. I'm going to, I'm going to put up signs on my town that says Ditto Gen 3 and he's going to, he's going to find it funny. He's going to find it funny. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm going to put up an, I'm going to put an Orange Crush logo in my town. Oh, that'd be funny. Oh, I'm going to be the next, everyone in the chat's going to love me. Meanwhile, I'll be holding the pattern here. Get in touch when you need tools. Campsite and the island villagers are separate. Okay. Alright, so let's see what's on. I think this is a, another basic island, isn't it? Well. Let's see if I can get the furniture. Never bring the vaulting pole here. I should. Basic island. There's this. Folding chair. Just what I always wanted. Just what I always wanted. Yeah, I've been to this island like every time I go to an island. I can never get the good ones. This sucks. Ah. May as well break the rocks for stuff. 9% chance for this island and other basic islands. I swear, I've been to this one, like, like, three times in a row now. 
just the boring island that has no, like, specific resource to spawn. This is the reason I don't go to these so much, because I keep getting this one. And you're telling me it's only a 9% chance? It's kind of hard for me to believe, to be honest. There's no unique fish or anything I can get here. It's just a unique island in case, you know, or basic island in case you're dumb and get rid of all your trees and stuff. I'm probably gonna re-roll. Get another island ticket. It even has roses as well. Like, I have plenty of roses in my town. I don't need roses. On the bright side, though, like, I have I have a bunch of um, Nook Miles. Like, this is my Nook Miles after I bought all of the terraforming options. Mm. You're going to make your island worse for my next visit. Oh, boy. Oopsie. Why did I turn around there? Listen, you know fully well that I'm going to visit your island again anyway just to put Raymond in the thumbnail. I did it for the clicks. And nothing else. Bop, bop, bop. Okay, now. Take this. I'm not even going to bother breaking the rocks since it just gives stone since I already hit them. I have more than enough stone. Hmm. Break this here. Uh, it really doesn't matter what the odds of the islands are. I get what I get. If I can get a gold nugget from this, at least, it might not be so bad. Um, I should check the beach for a bottle. There's a chance of, like, um, what is it? A fossil? Two somewhere? But I don't think I'm gonna see that. Plenty of roses, but roses are my main island flower anyhow. It's not even raining here. It was raining last night in my town. I managed to catch another coelacanth, a tuna, and an oarfish. All of which I'm, I'm keeping stored until CJ shows up. Nope. Alright, last rock. Let's get this. Keeps raining on my island. It, wouldn't, it almost never rains on mine. You won't have more than enough stone if you want to make a graveyard. Fair enough. But I only get one piece of stone. I have been storing so much stone since the start of the game, you don't need to worry about that, I don't think. Just take annoying to eat the fruit and that. Alright, let's leave. There's nothing here. I used other ways to make a graveyard. Oh, I see what you did there. Let's go. I'm gonna go take out my vaulting pole this time. For this at least. Because I never take it to the islands because I never use it on my main town anymore. Chad, I've also never seen a tarantula island. Every time I try to, to go at night, I never get it. Also, why can't you just buy Nook, I Nook Miles tickets at the airports? Just a, just a thought, Nintendo. Just a thought. Um, great, my house is all the way up here. I keep forgetting. Chat, do you like my town so far? I like it. I like it. I like... I feel satisfied working on it little by little right now. I gave myself a lot of room up here because I wanted to make a nice little yard for myself. Hmm. I got Tarantula Island four times, considering my attic. Yep. Yeah, I can believe that with your attic. Okay. Uh, there's not a section for tools here. Vaulting pole. So what do I have stored here? Yeah, I have a bunch of materials, as you can see. 
12 gold. Lots of iron. Lots of rocks. And lots of boots. For when I eventually want to make the trash stuff. Um. Oh, I have two of these stored? Let's take them. Sailor's ticket. And fossils to sell that I put away earlier. Folding chair. Uh, put it here. There we go. Good enough. I guess I'll just put this in storage. I can't sell it. Um, I'll get more at the... I better go grab an extra shovel is what I should do. It's probably going to break. I really wish you could use stuff in storage to craft. I don't have an extra shovel there. I don't want my other, other storage area. It's gonna take me a couple more, like half, more than half a week here to put all this, uh, all these townsfolk here. But I don't want to start building any other building like the yards or flowers until the houses are completely in place. There's shovels. See, I, yeah, I even have extra an uh, extra stack of stone right there. I have more than enough rocks. Lots and lots of rocks. Let's go again, chat. Hmm. I know if you customize, it technically restores durability, but it's like, I just put them, it's just faster for me to have extra ones to pick up there. Christian, you should visit Penny's Town. Are they even here? I don't think I've seen them for a bit. Anyways, Nook Miles ticket. You're always on a stone shortage? So I guess apparently I need lots of stone, chat. Alright, I'll start hoarding more rocks. Time to take off. Plenty of stone. Lots and lots of stone, chat. Especially when it's weed day. There you go. Send fences. An arch takes 90 stones. Oh, my. Um, but yeah, like, if, if I visit someone's town again, if they want to, if they have any extra DIY cards they want to leave out for me, like the, like, uh, how you did there... That would be appreciated, because I'm trying to learn as many things as possible, f specifically to put in my town. One of the gravestones is 30. Okay, I get it, chat. Rocks are important. Rocks are important. I've learned my lesson. But, let's see. Is this another basic island? I think it is. I'm never going to see, a, like, a resource island, am I? I'm never going to see anything cool. There we go. Alright, there we are. Break them after. I should have hoarded tickets for you. Chat, you know people are buying and selling Nook, Nook Miles tickets as well? Like, I have more miles than I know what to do with to buy those tickets. But people are just, like, actually selling them. Just buying, like, 10 or 20 at a time with real money. And I just... I, I That doesn't most likely hack. Yeah, people are probably hacking them and selling them. Like, those people that are just selling a million bells for, like, $20. Oh. It's weird to me. Yeah, people are doing giveaways of them, too, which also just looks so shady. But Animal Crossing, like, the reason stuff like that is happening right now is, um, people... Are, like, Animal Crossing, I think it's, like... I think this week it's outsold any Zelda or Mario game. Which is kind of huge.
kind of, kind of huge. So there's a lot of people playing it, so that's why there's a lot of shenanigans like this occurring. Let's see. It's cause of it's cause of the thing going on in the world, I guess. I'm pretty sure that's what I heard, is that Yeah, it's just Animal Crossing New Horizons has sold more than Mario like any more than any major Mario or Zelda game. Hmm. What's also annoying, though, is that this whole situation has... Like, Switch... Trying to buy Switches right now... Is just kind of, like, ridiculous. Because people are just, like, overcharging them so much. I saw that someone was... The other day, someone was selling the Animal Crossing theme Switch for, like, um... $1,200. Ridiculous, I tell ya. People are scalping. Switches are in high demand right now. Because people... Like, Animal Crossing's popular. People want a way to pass the time. And they can't really go out and buy them. They have to buy them online. So people are just jacking up the prices. Like, I've heard... I've already heard from several people right now saying, like, Yeah, I wanted to get a Switch for this, but uh, you can't... Like, Switches are ridiculous right now. Yeah. Let's see now. Break the rocks. Smack the rocks. Oh, don't don't jump over the holes. Wow. And if something breaks right now, it's also not a good thing. Like my the other day, my head my headphones fell apart. My expensive headphones that I use for streaming and, like, working and editing, basically anything. And they're broken. Right now, I'm using Dylan's while I stream because he's sleeping and he doesn't care. Or I'm assuming he won't care because I'm not going to wake him up to ask him. <laughs> like, right now, I can, they're still usable, but it's, like, falling off. I have to use duct tape just to have it hold together barely, and uh, I can't go out and buy new ones. Everything's overpriced online. It's just, ah. And right now, you know, money needs to be saved. Hmm. Amazon UK is selling basic Switch for 400 plus. Isn't that normal for it? Are you talking, are you talking pounds? I don't know how that, tra I don't know how that translates, honestly. Oh, there goes my shovel. Okay. How much of this stuff are you going to use? Well, I plan on making a graveyard, so I'm collecting the stone. Because pe as people keep telling me, stone is good. I may as well get extra wood here. The hardwood's good for making stuff. It's like 800 Canadian. Oh. Oh, boy. That's not good. Yeah, it's not good. It's really crappy. I hope, like, at the very least right now, people have something or can do something to stay positive and pass the time. But, gosh dang, I hate how there's people taking advantage of it. Hmm. It's such a pain. I know that Nintendo said they were going to up production of Switches for, like, official outlets so that people can to try and do something about the shortage, but, oh, great, well. Yeah, that ain't happening. Hmm. Yep, there ain't really nothing we can do about it until this uh, whole thing kind of blows over. Ugh. I miss my friends. Chat, basically, I just wake up, stream, or do YouTube stuff. And sometimes I, I meet my mom to go grocery shopping for the week. He sucks. I got stung. The baby did get stung. Let me eat these now. Remember, I'm trying to break the axes here. 
towards the gold axe. Oops, did I not eat? I'm gonna eat some more of these. Ugh. There's nothing we can do. There's nothing I can do. Just continue to work on stuff and give people more stuff to pass the time. Which, well, uh, speaking of which, I think I talked, tried to talk about this at the start of the stream. I got distracted. I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be trying to mostly next week to kind of alternate my stream days a bit. So I'm getting kind of... Gosh, I've been getting so exhausted and tired lately trying to get things done. I want to just, like, start doing having a day to stream... And then, and then the next day, I'll spend just doing stuff like making the thumbnails, uploading some stuff, and also working on the Yellow Channel projects I got going on. Because I'm finding that the best streams I have are days after I spend doing that. Do, trying to do a bunch of consecutive days just it tires me out too much, and I don't have time to take care of other stuff. I think my diet has also kind of taken a hit, and I'm just really j low energy lately. So I also want to have time to fix that. I know there's other people. Like, you know, the, the, the idea was like, oh, I want to try and stream as much as all the other people because they're, they're streaming every day. But the thing about those people is that, like, they have hired editors, people that manage their YouTube uploads and channels for them. All they need to do is wake up, stream, and then they're kind of good to go. I got to do all that stuff myself. Ugh. <sighs> I'm not, I don't think I'm even going to have time to record my video later today. I managed to actually get it entirely written yesterday, but I was so tired by the end of the day, I'm like, I can't, I can't record this. I need to go to bed. Hmm. Depends on how I feel later. I feel pretty good about it. I'm, I like, I, I, bleh, I more than tripled my progress yesterday when I was writing it because I've been stalling for a while. Let's see. Have Dylan do it for you when he wakes up at 4 p.m. Ah, that's fine. Dylan doesn't need to do it. The thing is, when I mention stuff like editing, taking up time, I, I, I always end up getting a bunch of messages from people that are like, hey, I'll edit your videos for you for free, and I, I don't like that because people who offer to do something like that for free obviously don't know how much work it actually is, so... Like, I, they're, they're, they're not, they don't know what they're signing up for, and I'm not going to deal with that. Plus, it would be, like, it would be pretty kind of scummy to get someone to do that for free anyway. But especially now of all times, I mean, I'd rather do it, work on it, my, do it myself. Because then I can be perfectly content with it. I don't want to have to worry about someone other doing it. Ah. Hmm. I can't really get someone and train them to do things the way I, I want at the moment. Let's see. Let me just get this fish, and then we're going to leave and try another island. Yeah, if you want something done right, do it yourself. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, I much prefer to do all my own editing stuff because, you know, then it, I, then it's, then I'm more satisfied with it. Let's see. Yep. Good work ain't cheap and cheap work ain't good. Yeah, true. Yeah, true. Ouch. I just gotta take care of my, take care of it myself, but it takes a long time. Out. What am I doing? I guess I'll. Do I want to store this stuff? Yeah, I should. I'm gonna go store stuff, and then I'm gonna try and roll another island. And I swear, it had better. It had better be a, a better island. Better. Did I say that word enough yet? Get on in here. Bop, 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 bop. Alright, let's see. I physically can't sell these fish, so I guess they're just going in storage until CJ shows up or something. 
Because I'm not going to bother taking them out just for Nook. The Wasp Nest. I could hang on to that. I think I have a DIY for that. Oops. No, no, no. I don't want to pick up the can. Hmm. Bluegill. And the rest of this can come with me. It's going to be... Some of the stuff's going to stack anyway. Hmm. Mm -mm. Let's see. We've been going nearly two hours with this, huh? So, we'll just go to one more island. That should be good. I've stored 300 items, so... I got, hey, I got Life Hacker. Check me out. See, it seems so easy to get Nook Miles, so I don't know why people are buying those. Lazy. Lazy. Oh, it's raining in my town now. It just started. It was cloudy, but now it's actually raining. So there's a better chance of finding uh, the good price fish here, but... Oh. Oh, Poppy just changed your outfit. Look at you! Oh, no. Sorry, I just... I mean, that looks really painful. You should get some medicine for that to start treating the swelling. And be careful shaking trees, okay? I get it. My face is stung. Yeesh. I feel like I'm looking at something I really don't want to see. Oh, it's you. I thought a zombie invasion had started. Better be careful shaking those trees, all right? Listen here, you little... You can only get away with so much from me. Give me medicine and you'll leave the, and you'll get to stay in town. Your face looks like it hurts. Yeah, don't pick fight fights with wasps. Wasps are nice, but they'll fight. No worries though, here. It'll heal right away with this medicine. You're alright, Rex. You're alright. I get stung a bunch too, so I always try to carry medicine. Chat. Y'all notice his, that his hat goes through his, his... His hat clips into his ears. I can't unsee that. Look at it. He's staying now. I've barely chatted with Rax. How is he a close friend? Are you sure it's only close friends that give stuff? It's the only hat he'll ever wear. Oof. Okay, so here we go. So, what are the chances of a villager being at a, a Nook, Nook Miles Island? Because I haven't seen one since the start of the game. So, yeah, Nook Miles ticket. Alright, this is the third one. P give something good, please. Oh, if you have available space, 100%. Someone's moving, though, and the campsite's open. You can at least invite them to the campsite, can't you? I thought that was how it... Hmm. Well, I'll have an open plot next time. Tomorrow, that is. Let's go. They have to be fully moved out. It's completely random when they come to the campsite. Well, all right. The game says no. Hey, bamboo! Well, I don't really want bamboo stuff, but I may as well get it while I'm here. You just store it. Uh, shovel? It's not here. Come on. There we go. I already have a bunch of stored bamboo anyway. I don't know if I really want to make any bamboo themed stuff. I've already seen it in a bunch of other towns, so I don't know if I want to make my own. Kind of want to do my own uh, graveyard, though. I really like the graveyard idea a lot. That's one of my favorite parts of your island. It was also one of the least um, ship posty parts of your island. Okay. Let's get some stuff. Kind of sucks that Red didn't show up in my town. Maybe he appeared. I'll check when I get back. Hmm. I can't believe I'm still so lazy to the point where I haven't, like, updated my town flag, but I just don't care. Hmm. I haven't put stuff in. Next time, there will be 69% more shipposting. Get lots of rocks, kids. 
Lots and lots of rocks. Oh, did we get enough? How did I not hit it fast enough that time? I haven't seen any gold nuggets. I've been storing every gold nugget I get my hand on, but... Be nice to get some other stuff. This. Just gonna mash this. I'm gonna fix my seat here. Alright. How's the capture card been today, chat? Is there um is there an audio desync? Been wondering about that. I was I'm still able to fix it. The last Mario Maker session went on YouTube just fine. Hmm, so it seems it's cooperating today. I guess I'll see in the footage. Seems fine. All right, that's good. This is probably the first time in, like, what, the last maybe six or seven times since I've used this capture card that it's actually not messing everything up. Maybe I won't have to actually put this through editing again. I can only hope. Take the bamboo shoots. Haven't noticed anything. Hope it stays fine for Mario Maker, then. see. Hopefully I don't overheat the stupid thing or something, though. Let me see now. Just break some of these rocks. Got a lot of extra clay. What do I need clay for? Something I never really end up using. Let's start breaking these axes and get some bamboo. There's no furniture that can drop from these things, right? I don't know. Hang on. Take a quick look on the beach, see if there's any, um... Any bottles. If I have an open plot of land, I guess I can try for a different villager that I might actually want next time. Something I can put in the thumbnail. Hmm. No bottle. Hmm. What are you talking about? There are pandas in this game. You ever heard of Chow? Chow the panda's been a villager for a long time. That. Bamboo. Bamboo! If you need a thumbnail, I have Anka. Well, I guess I'm going to your town next. The thumbnail. Thumbnails. Put that villager everybody wants. I do have an amiibo card for one character I do kind of want to move to my town. I think it's his name's called his name is Kid Cat. His amiibo card's pretty valuable. I saw it going for a cut for like around fifty dollars or so, maybe more. Um he's like the Power Ranger cat. He looks awesome. I found my amiibo cards, and I have I have a couple of decent-looking ones. But then you have, like, the really ugly mouse ca characters, like Limburg. Ugh. If you don't know who that is, like, look up his picture right now. He's disgusting. I think I have, like, two Limburg cards. I'm like, wow, I guess these are worthless. Hmm. Let me get... Rude. Oh, these are the things I got. Angled signpost. That looks nice. I could put that somewhere. Fence. 
Woodland. Whoa! I I put. When did I pick this up? Or probably earlier today. Need clumps of weed for it. Limburg is really disgusting looking. Hmm. Next time you come to my island, I have Marshall, Anka, and Julian. I don't know who Julian is. I got a knight's helmet. Fossil door plate. Oh! Did I get this from your- Did I get this from your town? I think I get, got it from you. Well, thanks. You can start- You started my graveyard. Appreciate that. These are definitely going to be useful to me. Oh, and the manga library wall. That is actually pretty sick. I want this. The reason people like Anka is because she's the Egyptian cat, Egyptian cat girl. So she's inspired many, many works of, let's say, fan art. Honeycomb wall. Bamboo bench. Thought you'd like it. Well, you're right. I did. I'm gonna make another shovel, because I'm gonna use this up first. Mm. Yeah, she has stuff. Listen, we all want to pretend that we know what- We all want to say reasons why certain Animal Crossing characters are popular and in high demand. We all know the real reasons. We all know the real reasons. We know them. I need more tree branches. I can't get them on this island, though. Um, I guess I'll just... Oh, no, no, no. I didn't want to do that. I didn't mean to pick the flowers. Just take some of the weed with me. I don't care about that butterfly. Let's see. No bottle that spawned. Be nice if a bottle spawned. All right, I'm gonna head back to my town now, chat. I think that's good enough. I'll do more tomorrow. Mm. All right. Looks like we're getting real close to the two-hour mark. So pretty good part to possibly. Hmm. Oh, is Julian the unicorn character? Explains why people like them. Oops, get in there. There you fool. Here we go. I haven't checked the Able Sisters in my own town today. Let's check. Anka has the most fan art of any villager. She's been in the game since, like, the GameCube one, if I'm not mistaken, right? Hang on, let's talk to Sable. Sable's been been opening up to me. Oh, Christian, I was hoping you'd come by today. I made a new, a new pattern fabric for you to try out on your custom furniture. Here you go. I started working on these during my breaks from shop stuff, but I got all excited and couldn't stop. So happy and wholesome. Uh-oh, battery's dying. I'll just plug it in between I wanna during the BRB fitness tank. Hey, we gonna work out everybody. Pullover jacket. I wish I had more opportunities to work out at home, but it's really kind of difficult. The lack of space. Casual kimono. Ultimate weave. Cheerleading uniform. Outdoor hat. <gasps> Frog hat? Look at it! so disgustingly awful. Mm, yeah. Check that out. Check that out. It looks like it has a horrified expression. <laughs> Ooh. The eye patch, but I can't wear my glasses with it. It's epic, bro. I'm, I'm gonna take the yellow one. I'm not going to wear it right now, but I'm going to take it. All these shoes. No, I don't need to wear it. But I'll take it. Alright. I got the frog. The frog, everybody! I want to come to this island now to get the frog. 
The frog, everybody. All right, before I end this, let's just go take a look to see if Red showed up. Because I want to... We've been going a good amount of time, and... I want to play some Mario Maker. I want to try the world, a new World Maker update. And I think this has been a fun session, so let's see. He should show up at this... He should show up here, apparently. This is the spot that he's supposed to show up at, but... He's not here. So I don't know what to really say. Other than that, he's not here. At least my uh, flowers are all going to be watered, and I have a better, ch another chance at getting some crossbred stuff. All right, but that seems all right. Okay. So this was fun. This was a fun little session. I'd like to do some more Animal Crossing soon too. Um, I like. I mean, today was was an update, but I didn't really do much with it. I planted some shrubs, and Red apparently won't show up for me till tomorrow, so... Okay. But we'll see how it goes. I hope you all enjoyed. I'm, I'm having fun with these Animal Crossing sessions. I like seeing different towns. I like working on my town. Just a little bit to do every day. It's fun. But for the YouTube audience, it's gonna be it. For the stream, we're gonna be setting up for Mario Maker in a moment. Have a good night. Bye-bye.